Bio Planet Wu is a Kyodai Hero themed tokusatsu that premiered April 9, 2006 and aired at 7.30 pm on NHK and ran for 13 episodes. Wu was one of many unused ideas created by Eiji Tsuburaya as story connecting to the show Ultra Q. The story revolves around a living creature which came from a comet named Wu. In the series, Wu is befriended by a young girl named AI. Both are chased by a mysterious organization called Sword who sees Wu as a threat to humanity. At the same time, giant monsters have invaded in search of Wu. The story itself follows the original script Tsuburaya intended for the show. In addition, a manga series was published a year later which was loosely based on the series of the same name. <laughs> <laughs> Main characters Wu, the only survivor of his species wandered in space until he crashed on Earth. There, he befriended AI and develops a strong bond with her that he'd protect her at any cost. He uses his antennae to connect to electronic devices mainly a cell phone to communicate with AI. AI Kumasiro, junior high school second grade. She stays with her mother and loves soccer. She travels with Wu after their encounter. Her school is then attacked by a giant monster, which resulted in her being the lone survivor of the attack. Kiyomi Kumasiro, Ai's mother and secondary chief editor at the magazine, Chemistry. Akita, a reporter of magazine, Chemistry, are the same publisher as Kiyomi. Kotaro, Ai's classmate. After he leaves working in the convenience store, his dream is to become a movie director. He seems to be attracted to AI. <laughs> Sword organization Yaman, the leader of Sword. It reveals that his daughter was killed in the incident that AI survived and because of that holds a personal vendetta against the alien life forms, including Wu. Kirishi, field agent for Sword. Katsura, field researcher for Sword, she eventually becomes an ally to AI and Wu helping them escape from her colleagues. Sakuraba, field agent of S.W.O.R.D. who keeps tabs on AI and Wu. Nagakura, biological researcher for S.W.O.R.D. He uses Wu's artifact and turns into the monster Gelnoid in episodes 12 and 13. Gonda, Katsura's sweetheart and ace combat specialist for S.W.O.R.D.'s mobile unit. He is portrayed by Shigeki Kagemaru, who played Guts member Tetsuo Shinju in Ultraman Tiger. Waver, head of Sword's mobile unit and his part of Sword's US branch in Arizona. Topic: <laughs> Wu's forms. Egg form, the shape Wu used to travel in space. Inflated form, an expanded version of normal form, Wu grows bigger than AI, but still fights monsters in its normal form. Fossil form, Wu reverts to this form due to exhaustion fighting as a giant. It takes water to revive him into his normal form. Rucksack form, due to Wu's shape-shifting abilities, he takes this form when traveling with AI to disguise himself from public. Akichi form, a fusion of Wu and Ai's energies resulting in Wu turning into a giant to fight other Daikaiju, after fighting he turns into his fossil form. Episodes. <inaudible> <inaudible> He fell from outer space. 
Aitsuga Yujo Kara Luo Chitekita Aitsu Ga Uchu Kara Okite Kita I will be killed. Watashi Sha Sariru Watashi Kora Sariru Hiro Born, Hiro Dansheng Hiro, Tanjo Wu, Don't Die, Wu, Sinanade Wu, Shinanai Da Counterattack Orders, Yingji Mingling Gaigaki Mare Farewell Wu, Sayonara Wu, Sayonara Wu New Terra, Sintanaru Kongbu Arata Naru Kaio Fu my whereabouts, Watashi no Juchang Suo Watashi no Ibasho Cornered, Jui Itsumarerit Oitsumarerit Sorry, Kotaro, Gomen Sio Tailang Gomen Ne, Kotaro Love for all, Rabufo Oru Rabufo Oru The final battle, Zui Hao no Daoi Saigo no Tatakai Bonds to the future, Weilai Henoban Mirai no Kizuna. Topic Monsters. Gelnaik Episodes One to Two. Galrobe Episode Three. Gelbelio Episode Four. Gelbile Episode Five. Gelbile MK, Episode Ten Gelnoid, Episodes twelve to thirteen Topic Manga A year after the show ended its run a manga shoujo series of the same name was published but compare to the TV show the manga features elements and traits that differs greatly from the show that the manga was loosely based on. Unlike the TV show the manga had a more light-hearted feel with a slice-of-life style genre thus distant it from the more Kyodai hero style series and because of this the manga solely focused on the main characters. <laughs> <laughs> Songs Opening theme Guardian Angel by Splash Candy Ending theme Kasa wa hitotsu de tariru no kana Sanhahitotsudzu rirunakana One umbrella is it enough By Girls on the Run Garuzu on Zaran Garuzu on Zaran Topic External links Bio Planet Wu on IMDb